are you? I've just put the primer on and I had to start the video again because my dog were barking his head off. We don't want that, do we? I'll just get another paper that I can wipe my brush on. I'm sticking to everything now. <laughs> right, we're doing the index finger and the middle finger. Let's hope it goes a bit better than the first one. This is a square ended brush I'm using. Feels a bit gritty, this brush. Never mind. And we'll do the cuticle as well. Seem to set a bit quick. It's fine, I've done it, just once filing. Oh, this wire. It's because my, my phone's plugged in. Come on. That should have been like the first one. Different brushes, isn't it? See what we're setting. Obviously, sets quick with the with the acrylic powder. But they go together, these two. I know people use them for different. Um, acrylics and stuff and so you should be able to say so you can do with the NSI I said a bit more in that corner Brush is sticking up now. Yeah, 
all right when it's failed. Oops. I'll put it in some acetone in a minute. Leave some acetone in it a minute and then I can wipe it out. Oh, where's my nail? My brush. All set properly. Like I said before, you become your own worst critic when you're doing nails. The file, my favourite one, is the blue one. What a wrong thing to get hold of. It is. brush and just brush it off to the side here use it to about Seven, this one, I think. Don't ever go on with this um, left handed. This on my finger, though. It's like rock hard, isn't it? Just file them side, sides down a minute. Put overhang on it.
would rather like that, but it did. Must have done it when it was setting. I thought it looked all right. Anyway, the thing is, when you get to be a nail technician, you can correct your mistakes. Which is a good thing to know, isn't it? Need to fill that down there. Outside, be quiet. We're back in a sec. 